Internal Revenue Service IRS Tax News. There's no news today, so we'll come up with a very random joke this time. Reincarnation sounds like a fancy, unfamiliar term to most Americans. We need to come up with an Americanized English word so we can understand the concept better. It's kind of like the word garage, where most people are like, oh, garage. Ooh la ti da, Mr. Frenchman, with your garage. Well, what do you call it? It's a car hole says Mo from The Simpsons. A car hole. A much more practical, descriptive American term. Similarly, with reincarnation, I propose the term re soul Because reincarnation seems like just nature's way of finding a suitable new soul hole. Therefore, reincarnation may be thought of as a fancy term for nature. re soul God, the universe, or whatever, is just like Man, I need to find a good, suitably sized meat hole to stuff this poor, unenlightened soul. Wow, this poor soul has shrunk quite a bit from its last re soul holing. I know what'll work. I'll stuff it into a squirrel. There, you see, that's a perfect fit. And then God, the universe, or whatever, moves along with his, her, or whatever's business. And for those that didn't like this poor unenlightened soul that God, the universe, or whatever just stuffed into a squirrel currently screaming, Ha! Karma! Or, God really humbled that jerk. Just note, that's the same kind of thing that shrunk this poor jerk soul down to where God, the universe, or whatever had to stuff it into a squirrel. Not that I like that jerk either much, but I'm just saying... God, the universe, or whatever, is not humbling or carmonizing souls with a scowl on his face. God, the universe, or whatever, is just trying to optimize space. Spiritual space, that is. Which we can't currently measure, but which I assume still needs optimizing. <laughs>